Barcelona vs Manchester City in a friendly match can already be known and will be reviewed in this article. Hi Football Mania! Back again with us who are definitely here for you to share the latest football news. Okay, without waiting much time, let's start right away. Today there is news from Barcelona vs Manchester City in a friendly match can already be known and will be reviewed in this article. Yes, the two teams meet each other at the Camp Nou Stadium. Barcelona on Thursday August 25th. The friendly match titled Charity Match ended in a 3-3 draw for both teams. Even though it was only a charity match, Barcelona and Manchester City still showed their best abilities in that match. For your information, the match was held by Barcelona and Manchester City to combat amyotrophic lateral sclerosis. ASL itself is a disorder that attacks the brain and spinal cord which can cause paralysis. The disorder quite often attacks people who are elderly. Former Barcelona player, Juan Carlos Anzu, previously also experienced ASL since two years ago. This match is intended for former Barcelona coach and goalkeeper Juan Carlos Anzu who suffers from ALS which is a nervous system disease that affects muscle performance so that he is physically weak. Juan Campanzu had the disease two years ago. Barcelona's match against Manchester City was attended by around 91,062 spectators. All proceeds from ticket sales will be donated to the charity Foundation Luzon, a non-profit organization that helps people with ALS. Back to the game, since the beginning of the match. Both the citizens and the Blograna have indeed shown very tight competition. Both teams exchanged goals from the first half to the last minute of the match. Julian Alvarez was able to become the first player to score in that match for Manchester City in the 21st minute. But not long after, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang managed to make it 1-1 in the 29th minute, which lasted until the end of the first half. In the second half, Barcelona turned ahead thanks to a goal created by Frankie de Jong in the 66th minute. But the advantage did not last long after Cole Palmer was able to equalize again in the 70th minute. In the 79th minute, Memphis Depay again managed to put Barcelona ahead and almost won the game. Even so, Manchester City finally succeeded in forcing a 3-3 draw thanks to Riyad Mahrez's goal in the 90 plus 9 minute. Erling Haaland considered diving in the Barcelona vs Man City match, is that really in a charity match? Manchester City bomber Erling Haaland has received criticism from many netizens after being accused of diving in a friendly match against Barcelona, Thursday August 25th. In the match which was held at Camp Nou, there was a chase for the score between the two teams. Barca still winning 3-2 until the second half of injury time. However, Manchester City then received a penalty after Andreas Christensen was deemed to have violated Holland in the forbidden box. If you look at the replay, Christensen's knee is in contact with Holland's leg, although it is very thin. However, many netizens still think that Holland is diving or pretending to fall. Here is the latest news from Football Mania, the news also closes our meeting this time, stay tuned on the Football Mania YouTube channel, 
because we will present the latest and most complete news about football. Don't forget to click the like, comment, and subscribe buttons. is clearly City's designating as a step up and he's about to thump it into the roof of the net and City have made it 3-3 1,000 people the team managers embrace with smiles I think that's probably something that they're both delighted with 3-3 draw 